Yeah, welcome to Red World News. It's 2024, general elections is in 2025. Can you imagine like politicians consulting their playbook right now? The name of their playbook, not playbook. Yeah, they have a playbook for politicians in Trinidad. It's called Trinidad Politics for Dummies. In one corner, you have the UNC pandering to police officers. We feel your pain. The government doesn't care about you. We will ensure you get your pay increases. In the opposite corner, you have the PNM. Like the UNC, their playbook only have one page with four tactics. Tactic number one, free food. Tactic number two, free rum. Tactic number three, what's tactic number three? Pave roads, especially in places like Barakpo. Tactic number four, talk about solving crime because that is all they could do, talk about solving crime. Because they just don't know what to do about crime in this country, you know. It's clear as D to you and to me. <laughs> Fitzgerald Hines, he can't find the playbook. Rohan Cinnamon, he holding the playbook upside down. You could imagine them fellas face when they see a 600 page report. Rohan Cinnamon was like, you read this report? No, I was playing golf. The report looked into the Trinidad and Tobago police service and found that they, the police service, they wounded and they demoralized. Oh, so sad that the police service is wounded. Maybe that is why you have so many police related let me do good. They make it sound like police officers need a hug. You know what police officers in this country need? They need ice cream. Anyway, with no other plan in sight, it makes sense for the Prime Minister to comment on this report. The more or less suggest that it's the commissioner who is responsible to action the plans. And I guess he's right because politicians really shouldn't be involved in, in police business. I don't know. Then you have Professor Emeritus, Dr. Uh, Ramesh Diosarain saying that what the police service needs is a police inspectorate that could review things like uh, the levels of performance, levels of absenteeism. Wait, 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 wait. You're telling me that they don't have that? They don't have an inspectorate? They didn't have one back in 2017 and they still do have one in 2024? And I don't know if you know this, but emeritus is the word that you use when you had an official title, but then you retire, but is allowed to retain their title as an honor. Honestly, I'm a little bit embarrassed because for all this time, I thought Professor Diosaran's name was Emeritus Ramesh Diosaran. It's not. Red Wall News.